Imagine going to a restaurant, taking a bite of your favorite food, and choking on a plastic bag hidden inside. For sea creatures, the ocean is their restaurant, and in the ocean are entire floating islands of garbage. It's all too easy for a whale or a sea turtle or any number of other animals to accidentally eat some of this plastic. Hi, I'm Alexandra Rylander, and this is where my project comes in. I'm going to share with you the questions that inspired this project, as well as a brief outline of what I expect to be doing. First, I have an essential question. How can we take what is already being done to ban plastic bags throughout the world and use it to start a campaign to ban plastic bags locally? This question, and this issue overall, is extremely relevant to the future of the planet. It deals with a central problem shared by the entire world, human impact on the environment. It is important to teach people how and why what they do impacts the environment and why they should care. Most importantly, it deals with solutions. Now that we know what we're doing is bad and we care, we can work towards ways to reduce our impact. This leads to my research question, which is the following. Collaborating with ongoing efforts throughout the world, how can we encourage communities in Boston to prevent further waste from entering the ocean by stopping the use of plastic bags in individual homes, businesses, or even in the entire city, as well as educating the public about the dangers of plastic bags in the ocean? This question is too large to stand on its own, so I have some further things to look into. First, what are effective ways to teach people about the dangers of plastic bags? Second, what has already been done to reduce the use of plastic bags in the world? Third, how can we convince people and organizations to stop using plastic bags? My project would answer most, if not all, of these questions. I would start with research on plastic bag banning worldwide. I would then take that information to help start my own campaign to ban plastic bags in Boston, as well as increasing public awareness of the dangers of plastic bags. I would do my own research on the public's opinions about this topic. I plan to talk to both large supermarkets and smaller grocery stores about banning plastic bags. I would also talk to local newspapers and other media about PSAs or something similar in order to educate the public about this issue on a large scale. Hopefully, by the end of the year, Boston will be a more educated and environmentally conscious city on behalf of this project. Change happens one person at a time, yes, but at this point, that isn't enough. If we are ever going to fix anything, we need change to happen one city at a time. Thank you all for listening, and I hope that you will support my cause.